Alright, that. Wonder about that. Did. Oh! Did our parents. Did our mom and dad do something like that? Back then, laying in bed, I could hear mom and dad chatting through the walls. They had such a bond back then. I don't know when their idle chatter turned into deafening silence. Later, Dad only came home when he got roaring drunk. Mom always huddled in a corner trying to hide her tears. Ah. So they had a private investigator, I imagine. Wait, this is a door? Oh, down there is a door. Alright, fair enough. Hey, clock. Uh, let's see. This one was a square corner piece. Corner piece, I don't think that's quite right. There we go. Corner piece, and this was a number one. I think these two would need to be switched. Alright. Pretty sure that's. Pretty sure that's it. Any notes on this? No, alright. I know how to solve the puzzle! Damn it. Hmm, okay, let me leave it alone for now. Let's explore a little bit more. Okay, where we're at. Let's see. The teacher's desk. On it are plenty of assignment papers. More than enough, thank you. This room. Oh, there's something underneath. Can I get it? No, that's the furniture. Okay, never mind. Piece of the furniture. Alright, uh, apparently there's something to do here. I'm not activating anything. Let's go try that clock again. Might as well. Unless you guys have something to say about all this. No? Okay. Three clocks. None of them are running, but it looks like I can turn the hands. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know why, but it doesn't seem I'm doing it right. Let's 
It's very precise, it sounds like. A slight clicking, so I don't know if that's something to do with it. So I'm just gonna try here. Stupid thing just to find out what's wrong. Ah, <sighs> how bothersome. Alright, I think I gotta figure it out. At first, it took me a while because I was trying to do it like this, but then I realized that the photos weren't quite correct. So you have to straighten them up forward and then judge it based upon that. So, the way it should be for Daddio is 6. 45 and then mom oh, it was two o'clock I believe two o'clock or one o'clock somewhere around there right that is pixel perfect maybe it's one o'clock it's kind of hard to tell there we go, that sounds a lot better. Alright, blood everywhere. Fabulous. Oh dear. Oh dear. One day, Dad came home and inebriated and tripped at the front door. I couldn't stand seeing him on the ground all the time, so I went over to give him a hand. Besides the scent of smoke, there was another smell. A faint smell of powdered makeup. Ooh. Daddy, you in trouble? See, what was over here? Oh, this room that had nothing to do with anything. Alright, so there's that one door. Hopefully it unlocks now. Let's head on over now. Chime in. They're going crazy. Wonder if a wedding's going on. Okay. I expect that? No. All right. So far this has been kind of straightforward. A little confusion here and there, but... So far the puzzles were kind of straightforward in what they wanted. Pink grass. Hey Doc, how's it going? I'm assuming you're a Doc, I don't know. I received your paper plane. 
I was truly worried you were still having trouble at home. But it looks like my concern was slightly unfounded. Like the white daffodil, you are innocent, vain, and candid in nature. Perched aside a pond in snow white, admiring your reflection. Being different from others can be a tough way to live. But I think I can understand that feeling. You said you want to learn more about my time abroad? All I can say right now is that my past is rather complicated. Unfortunately, many horrible things have happened on this land in the last decade. Believe it or not, our society wasn't always like this, oppressive and cold. Perhaps we should take a stroll down the boulevard on the weekend. There are things our censored textbooks don't mention, but are definitely worth knowing. You want to take me out on the weekend? What? Paper plane. It's my paper plane. Toss my worries out and receive your guidance. Oh, was that my guidance counselor? Okay. to do anymore. Can't see anything at the window. Where else could this be? Oh wait, 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 wait. What's this? Radio station. Ah, oh, okay. New radio station's channel. Launch 103. Shame it's not 101. Otherwise I would have to make a stupid radio reference. But why bother? All right. Let's slowly and surely get over there. You bitch. This music's kind of nice too. Okay, everything's just all over the place. Oh. Okay. Flashlight. The light. Whoa! Um. Okay. Sure. Why not? Okay. No shadow or reflection. This has a reflection. This does not. Okay. Oh, is this a puzzle? Okay. I think this is a puzzle. Okay. Quite blatantly obvious a puzzle. Duh. Okay. Does that do with the guy? I think it has to do with him. Yeah. Do I take you to the end, buddy? Alright, that needs to be turned on, I guess. Hope you're okay, buddy. Yeah, he's still following me. Okay, yeah. He's the piece. Straight. Alright, you are backwards. Make you go through. Oh. Uh. There you go. Time to open the door. That was simple enough.
I drew this when I was little. It was always kept, even when we moved the furniture around. Huh. That's nice. My mom would have beat the shit out of me if I ever drew on the walls. Was there a hand? I thought I saw a hand. Oh, yep, there we go. Received a coin! Got a lucky coin! Yay! Theater's ticket counter. What are we doing in a theater now? Door shut tight. Do we use it on here? Do I use it on here? <laughs> this doesn't do anything, okay. Missing something. Oh, wait. I get a coin. Do I do something to the piggy bank? Let's see. Assuming if I can go back there. I thought it was strange to have the piggy bank there. Fed today. Be happy and rejoice. Put coin in Piggy Bank? Yeah. Alright, and then flip it upside down and break it. Okay. Hopefully, something happens when I do that. Bank. Tell me your secrets. Uh -huh. Got a movie theater ticket. Yep. Knew it was going to do something like that. Alright. Let us go back here and go see a movie. Because where the hell not? I mean, I don't know about you, viewer, but I want to see a movie, okay? And it better be epic. Movies these days just suck. Except for the Avengers movie. That was actually pretty badass. What the fuck? This is lagging the fuck out of my computer. My computer is not happy with this. Oh my god. It's the way it was at the beginning of the episode. Good day and welcome. We hope you enjoy your movie. Yeah, make this shit go away. Because this is bad. And scary and frightening and colorful and bright. And my computer did not appreciate this. There we go. Yeesh! Oh... Is our counselor a love interest? Oh, 
that's what he is. We got, oh, we lost our pendant. Yeah, when did we lose that? Um, what else do I do? I was hoping that would take me to a new area or something. I don't know what to do. Hello, sir? Do you have to trash my apartment? What's this? A note on the floor. Search warrant. Uh oh. A search warrant issued by the district court with a list of public officials involved in a bribery scheme. Uh oh. When I went home that day, father had already been taken away. I asked mom what had happened. She quietly replied, Dad got his hands dirty, but he'll live. Hearing this, I felt as if she was smiling underneath. Damn. So, our dad got to j went to jail. Man. Assignment book. What? A reasonable excuse to enter the counseling office. Oh, okay. Where's the counseling office? I think it was the second one. Was it? No, it was the first one. This fucking music, man. It's great. I love it. No joke, though, actually. I do like it a lot. <laughs> Gives me that nostalgia feeling when I used to watch really old Disney cartoons. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the one. Oh, is this no longer the room? Shit. <laughs> was it number two and I was overthinking it? Damn it. Oh well, it's bound to happen. Bound to get the few rooms that we ac have access to confused. sense the story a little bit. I'm a little conf somewhat confused. It's still making sense, obviously, but as we go along, but it's just interesting. Because I wonder if she was so upset with her family life that she fuck. She kind of ratted out on people or something. Or maybe that was her dad. Or no, he was went to jail for bribery, okay. No. So maybe she did and this is her punishment. Oh, well, luckily my computer isn't lagging because of this, Jesus. Alright, dead fish, eaten fish, nails in a wood piece. Paper planes everywhere! Oh. The teacher's desk. On it are plenty of assignment papers. Um. Is this on you? Miss Fang. The counseling process is near its end. 
I'm glad you're back on track. And hopefully won't be needing me anytime soon. If there isn't anything else you should you should return to class now. I still have plenty of assignments to look at. Wow, did we just get dumped? Counseling records. What does it say? It's over. No matter what's been written on here, there is only farewell. Oh. Yeah, looks like we got dumped. Fuck. Okay, um, hmm. I'm not sure where to go now. I'm getting a little confused. Dang it, I'm having a hard time remembering where places are. Yeah, these are the clocks. Hmm. Alright, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a pause and see where I'm supposed to go next, because I'm a little bit confused. So I'll be back in just a moment. Wait, never mind. Never mind! Save progress, yes. That act that area is now accessible. Oh. Our room. And us. Check it out. Okay. Just silent treatment. Let's get off stage. If we can, I don't know. What do you want me to look besides just dots? Paper plane. A glass cup of nauseating color, overflowing with the stench of human corruption. Plates and cups clash against the walls as father's voice roared through the halls. After a series of curses seeping, all that's left is mother's weeping. Our family was once sweet together, healthy and caring when we gathered. And now, every night a restless sleep, every morning hard to wake. So it goes on day by day, the anguish digs ever deep. I was shattered into countless pieces, mirroring the crumbling of a familiar world. In a state of ceaseless decay, plunging into a river of despair, floating in limbo for the rest of our days. Okay. Anticipating when we meet, footsteps ever quick and slight, roaming through a neon forest, strolling past the dazzling lights. I've become a little lark, brushing past the pretty flowers, chasing all the playful butterflies, I glide merrily by your side. I've been an actor in our play, long before the curtains arise. Being held is ever comforting, longing for your love embracing. Listening to your many whispers, feeling each other's tranquil breathing. 
The white deer walked into my grasp. What a pleasant surprise. What a turn of fate. What a... I want to keep this moment in my palms for eternity. Something tells me that didn't last long, though. All of a sudden, we stopped meeting. You became distant, bitterly. Colder than the sun could melt, air around you freezing instantly. And my frozen body's beating heart, with each pulse tearing itself apart. Again, I'm left in abject solitude, in a house that I call home, in a space that I call school. A walking corpse whose mind's without, a sense of loss that's drowned with doubt. So, family was great, then it came shitty, but then she had a boyfriend, and then he became shit. Chang Ming Hu, we need to talk about this. Miss Yin, it's not necessary to raise your voice like that. Why can't I? What were you thinking, going after a child like that? Child? I was already studying abroad at her age. She's old enough to know what she wants. So what now? Would you lead her down this forbidden path? She only needs a push in the right direction. Enough for you to wrap your arms around her. This is our private matter. It's none of your business. How is it not? You're stuck in your little romance. Did you forget about us? Y us? Excuse me? We were already in the same boat. Don't you forget. Oh, did we kind of snitch on Miss Yin because we thought she and the counselor were a thing? And then Miss Yin kind of ruined it? Or at least we blamed Miss Yin. Yeah, because there's that paper saying, hey, if you know anyone, you might be a traitor, call us. And she did it, and we did it out of revenge. Okay. Oh, did he get taken too? Oh, did we do that too? Ah, oh, out of anger? A painful recollection. My soul is shattered into pieces. When I cannot put myself back together and forget everything, I open my eyes and welcome a barren world. We're changing characters again, apparently. Okay. Are we a ghost now? Pretty sure we have to follow the kid, but let's go over here for a second. No, I can't enter any of these, so alright. Let's follow the kid. Just like Alice and following the white rabbit. Do you go through here? It's weird. Why would he go through here? Okay, can't do the breathing anymore, so... Gotta go. 
Our life would vanish, but not our guilt. I am you, yet you are not me. It's the sin that makes you linger in this realm. Memories like mirrors reflecting the true likeness of your soul. In a world full of pain and suffering. Fangration, what do you fear the most? Let's see, family was kind of pretty important to her. Exit, okay. Alright. Heard some noises, so let's see what's that about. I wonder if any choice would have mattered. I didn't click anything, that just automatically went up. Same thing with you, apparently. Okay. It's really trippy. Well, not that trippy, but... Very interesting. I like how a lot of games are kind of pretty good at just keeping a black and white atmosphere, but being also extremely creepy about it. And we saw that kid, so let's go through there, I guess. The bonfire of hope is almost depleted, diminishing in the wind. Oh. Some of the book's contents might conflict with your everyday thoughts. But this material will help you engage in reflective and independent thinking. Well, let's call it a day. I do want to remind you all again to never mention the book club to anyone else. For that might put yourself and others in great danger. And Wei, I'd like to ask you a favor. Yes, Miss Yin, is it about the new books? I've already given the list to Mr. Chang. He said the shipping company won't help us anymore, but he'll figure something out. The government is enforcing restrictions on all imports. Soon, the book club might come to an end. Ah. Miss Yen, why are things like this? Because people are stupid, that is why. I'm sorry, Wei. There's nothing I can do either. And the government's also stupid because we elect them that way. Oh, just one more thing before you go. Mr. Chang? Mr. Chang never brought us any of those books in the first place, right? <laughs> I know you can always- I can always count on you. Why is this book floating? Like, look at that! It- the edges are just like tipping the- the edge of the desk and it's just like levitating. Like, Woo! Now that is real spookiness right there. Clipping. Bla blacklisted to return home for burial. Half a century in exile. Blacklisted to return home for burial. During the period of martial law, Miss Yin Sui Han was a wanted political fugitive. She was lucky to evade arrest and left the country only, only to be blacklisted. She traveled the world fighting for human rights and freedom of expression but unfortunately died of lung cancer at the age of 50. Her last wish was to be able to return to her hometown. Now this wish can be achieved with the lifting of martial law. Oh, well, good for you, Miss Yin. Can I do anything over here? No, okay. Fair enough, fair enough. Let's see, where to now? Can I get out of here? Oh. 
The door's over here, duh. have a chat. The way forward is the path to your past. However, the road ahead has crumbled. Lead me anywhere and I will follow you like a shadow. Oh. Okay. So her handle's broken and can't get in. Alright, fair enough. Just trying to check out what I can do and what I can't do. There we go. Thought you said you'd follow me, but no. Ah! Sliding door is wrapped in barbed wire. Ooh. Oh. Can't really talk to her, so whatever. Can't open this door. Why not? Can't open this door. Come on. Okay. So I imagine we're kind of back at school and out of weirdo craziness territory. But if that's the case, why is the school so like this? Who can be calling me at a time like this? I don't know. Ah, uh, shit. There's a phone call and I want to answer it. That chick won't get out of the way. Hmm. Sorry for being a little quiet. I'm not really sure what to make of it while I try to figure out what to do. Oh wait. Uh, maybe if I went back to that one chick. The shadow. The shadow kind of followed me to the other side. Don't follow me you fucking idiot! Stay on this side! Unless there's something I'm supposed to do on the other side. Wait, I couldn't get the door open though, right? Door handles broken and I can't get in. Okay, so how am I supposed to do this? I'm not supposed to do that yet. Maybe. Okay, that's fine. Let's see what else I can do here. Um, fuck nothing. Oh, well then, okay, I'm an idiot. I just figured it out. 
Okay, I'm an idiot. I can't believe I didn't get it at the first try. Oh my god, I feel stupid now. I feel stupid. We could go across, but then go down here, go back across and go up, and then cross yourself, and then switch back. There you go. Mystery solved. My god. I feel dumb now. I feel dumb! I'll worry about the phone call later. There you go. Alright. Switch back with me. Remember when you enrolled? So full of passion. Participating in every school activity, showing off your academic abilities, grabbing the attention of your peers and teachers. Then things took a turn for the worst at home. All the attention quickly turned into unwanted scrutiny. So you choose to escape, I guess. The world is immeasurably fast. There is always a place to hide. You are me. Like so. This place is completely lifeless. Even ideas are buried here. Remember to thoroughly destroy each book and add the spirit money to throw them off. There can't be any intact book pages or else this would be for naught. Hey, Wei. You're closer with Miss Yin. I heard that she had to flee the country overnight. Is that true? I'm not sure. She never said anything about leaving. Unlike Miss Yin, we don't have the con connections to guide us to safety. Aren't you afraid? Well, actually, what bothers me the most is, do you know how the reading list got leaked out? Stop asking questions. I'm as clueless as you are. Let's just hurry up and finish this. We don't want to get caught. He he he, I wonder who that snitch could have been. Her in verdict from court. A torn piece of the verdict. Ching Ming Hu, district level educator, is found guilty with students, Wei and others of collusion with communist forces. Ching Ming Hu is to be put to death after the court's ruling. Wei Chung Ting pleads guilty to affiliation with communist forces, reading a prohibited text with rebellious and corrupt thoughts. He'll be sentenced to 15 years jail time. Wow. Jesus. Times are not good right now. Hey buddy, how's it going? I'll follow you follow you to the end. I guess. I have no other choice, really. Oh, there you are. Let's get inside here. Uh-oh. The door is barred by a broom. There's a note on top of it. Snitcher. Remove the broom. And <laughs> it levitates. Why not? room, but whatever. Oh, no more piano puzzles, I swear to god. I'm sick of them. 
Too many notes to keep track of. Who the fuck are you, buddy? Let's see. No entry. Excerpt. That time in fear, forcing herself to breed hatred? Who knew that she would take that leap and leave this world behind? Nary a last word because of fear? Remorse? The reason remains undecided. I was left with a blur of confused thoughts spiraling through my mind. When I saw the sunlight again, things had changed drastically. My loved ones and teacher went to a higher place. She was buried in an unmarked grave leaving me a decryptic man. Huh. That's a little odd. Was that note from the guy, then, who was just playing the piano? we feel blessed. Oh, okay. Why am I back here? Well, I guess it's going down through the whole area. There's a note on the cart. Yeah, probably. Another light. Okay. Just probably can't turn on the light. Oh, <laughs> didn't mean to do that. Okay, imagine it's like the mirror puzzle again. Or glass shard puzzle, whatever the fuck it was called. Um, no, okay. Do I have to stop her and talk to her? Oh, God damn it! That's right next to the fucking door! Come on now! can. Ah, turn this on. And then go back here. Oh my, oh my god! That's gonna be the death of me right there. Get on over here. Acting immediately on one's determination, this is the philosophy he believed in. That someone should take fate into their own hands. With you following him, what ideas do you hold? Take hold of one's destiny. That is a charming thought. So life has gained a goal. Next to him, you found yourself. You are me. All right. Sounds about right. No matter how many times this replays, nothing can be unwound. 
You can never redeem yourself. Oh, there's a police guard. Instructor Bai? This is the book list I mentioned before. I found it on our teacher's desk. Miss Fang, the country appreciates your assistance. So it was us, yep. Kinda figured. Did you think finding something to rely on would stab off your fear? One day, however, he was gone just like that. You've lost everything you can depend on. What choice will you make now? Quietly accept. There's nothing to change. Because I already fucked up. Literally. Uh, hold on one second. Okay, there we go. I had to kind of redo that stuff. I don't know why the system would not work. That was a little weird. In a sense, it crashed on me. <laughs> don't know what cost it though. Hey, it's you, buddy. you going? You were playing a piano earlier. Let's see. Oh, he opened this. I checked this way to ca just in case what it was. And it was just a locked door, but now he opened it. Oh. Is that? Well, let me see something. I don't fucking care about this. Give me to the notes. Uh, let's see. Where is it? Chung Ting pleads guilty to affiliation with communist forces, reading a prohibited text with rebellious and corrupt thoughts. Will be sentenced to 15 years jail time. So, wait. Is that way? he went to jail. Memories are like a mirror, reflecting the true likeness of your soul. Hmm. Maybe you still want to forget. Maybe you're still afraid. Oh, I'm terrified, alright. No need to worry about that. Facing your own aspirations, but not confessing to the truth. I am you, yet you are not me. Oh! 
The river of blood is back, baby. You thought it was gone? Yeah, right. Constantly cycling over and over with the only river shuns you at the end of your journey. Yet the knot of sin still lies unsolved. The bridge leading to Paramedia lies in collapse. So the Requiem with the warm crescendo welcomes you once again. Oh. Here's the pull? No. Jesus Christ. Pretty sure we've had enough of this creepy ass uh, scenery and the creepy ass noise. We can move on now. Or at least we would if Ray would hurry the fuck up! Everyone's clapping for me. the diploma. Oh! So we killed ourselves. That's why we're constantly on chairs, because that's the chair we use to kill ourselves in. Okay. school though like well, like why is it this bad like, why did it get abandoned I imagine I imagine it's abandoned so why is it abandoned is my question but yeah it sucks for Ray that's it All right. Well, that was detention. All right. I liked it. It wasn't too bad. That one puzzle I really could not figure out, though. That stupid locking puzzle. And then that stupid fucking piano puzzle. No. I don't know why, but I'm really bad at, like, hearing the notes correctly. Like, it, it'll either sound higher pitched or lower pitched than it should be. And so I get confused pretty badly, and that would have taken me just five fucking years just to get through, I assure you. So, yeah, best to have cheated and just proceed on. So I'm not only just wasting your time, but not wasting my time either. But, yeah, other than that, that was real interesting. Uh, really wasn't expecting that kind of ending. I mean, we started out with Wei and just like, Oh, hey, Wei, how's it going, man? Then all of a sudden we started at, started playing the game with Rei and her story. That was a little interesting. I kind of did like the gameplay. At first it was a little confusing for the way it was, but... Afterward it got, after you get used to it, then it's like, oh, Okay, yeah, I see how it goes, okay. It's not that bad. Or that not bad at all, I should say. But yeah, the story was actually really good. It was really impressive. I wasn't really sure what to expect of this. But, yeah, quite an interesting story. But thank you guys for checking out Halloween time this time around, and uh, I hope to see you more in more episodes. To come. So until then, I'll see you next time.